We bought the craziest sneaker accessories on the internet, so you don't have to. From getting crease protectors that can save your shoes from a car crash, all the way to a water repellent guard that can help you walk on water. We bought a bunch of things here that do a lot of different things. You gotta tell us in the comments which ones are your favorites and which you're getting. First one we're gonna unbox is this SPF protection film. It's a repellent for your sneakers that can protect it from pretty much uh, any sort of spillage. Let's check it out. How this works is you're supposed to spray at the shoes for from a distance of about 10 centimeters till they're a bit damp. You then leave them to dry for uh, between a half hour and one hour. And then you spray them again and leave them for a period of 12 hours till they're ready to go. So we're gonna keep doing that through the course of this video till we can test them out. That takes us to our next product. These here are very standard crease protectors. They're plastic equipment that goes inside your shoe to sort of Protect them from creases. It's pretty simple, you slide them in. We keep one shoe without one shoe with so you can see the difference. Same amount of pressure on both shoes. Next accessory is to fix shoes that get yellow from what is known as oxidization. It's pretty common in certain white sneakers with a very specific material. Let's take a look. This comes with a white out deoxidizer and a shoe cleaning towel which seems to be some sort of microfiber cloth. He would know, it doesn't work that way. Next up, we have cleaning wipes. Probably one of the most popular sneaker accessories there is. It's pretty straightforward. You get one out, uh, rip it open, and boom. We have a little wet wipe here. Rough edge, or I'm assuming rougher spots and a smooth edge, smoother spots. We got a dirty pair of shoes from Manchu. This is what it looks like before. We can get down to scrubbing it off. I must say this rough side is actually pretty good. Feels fairly effective. This is what the shoe looks like after. I don't know about you, but this midsole looks like it's come a long way from where it started. It's also fairly cheap at uh, $9.99 a box. That's at least what we're selling them for on our website now. I think they're more expensive uh, regularly, but they're available on the Macy's website for $9.99, so you should go get them. We're back here 30 minutes later for an updated quote on these shoes with our spray. Uh, the instructions say we're supposed to spray them again a few times and then leave them for 12 hours. That's it, we'll be back here in 12 hours. Our next accessory is something known as a sole guard or sole protector, whatever you want to call it. Essentially, they're like thick plastic films for the soles of your shoes that I don't seem to have around. But you peel off the plastic bit, stick it under the shoe, uh, you cut it into the shape, and then use a heat gun to sort of uh, melt it into place and make sure it stays. It comes with an alcohol swab, which I guess is like a sneaker wipe of its own. So if this is not good enough, use sneaker wipe, wipe that sole down, make sure it's super clean, stick this on, and then you're pretty much good to go. Basically keeps your outsoles intact. Next up, we have a backup waterproof silicone shoe cover. In case your uh, SPF is not good enough and you don't want to use those wipes, we have basically socks for your shoes. I mean, I'm gonna try putting them on, but they go on to any shoe. Hey. And there you go. The shoe is now safe from, I guess my book in stocks are safe from puddles and other debris. Okay guys, I've tried the water cover <laughs> and uh, now I'll be putting some water on this. Let's see how it goes. Our next accessory might increase gel insoles is what is written here on the box. I guess you know what that means. Here are the insoles that come with one long like sort of gel base which I think gives you like an inch and then you have these 
basically these add-ons which can allow you to, you know, stack that height value. So you can totally stack up to that much height, which just seems like a hell of a lot. But let's go ham all the way and see what. Yeah, my foot is basically out. But, uh, oh, I feel the height difference. Maybe with like a little less height, it'll be more practical. Huh, think I can dunk? Sure, we should. Too short. It's been north of 12 hours since we uh, double coated these shoes. Uh, we're gonna check first with a little bit of water. Oh, that's pretty cool. Water is lame. Water would get off anyway. We're gonna put this ziti to the test with some Heinz tomato ketchup. Not sponsored. Not sponsored yet. It's fairly garnished, I wanna say. Let's see if we can wash it off. Let's see if it'll wipe right off. Look at that. Wipe right off. Well, that's actually impressive. All in all, I see no ketchup left on the shoe and that's, if you ask me, quite impressive. Shwam, can we have your other shoe that's not coated so we can check what ketchup does to a regular shoe? <laughs> <laughs> Obviously no. Right, well that's the uh, SPF. This here is another product from Needs Leather Laces. Uh, they're basically laces that come in different colors that are made of, I mean, you guessed it, leather. I think give a more premium look to your sneakers and just feel nicer to have them on. We have them here in white. Just feels like a nicer lace. It's not made of cloth. It has like these metal aglets. A nice teal color. A very nice pop in pink. Our next accessory is one of the most popular formats of displaying your sneakers. This here is a fancy, fancy sneaker crate. Come to set it up. Called the sneaker wall. One eternity later. And this here, finished product. Plus, they can stack one on top of another. And they have these sort of vacant um, circuit openings to connect them. So you just need to plug in one power cord and they'll power the whole stack. It's pretty dope. Our last two accessories are, in my opinion, the most exciting. This here is a pair of headlights for your shoes. Play that back if you didn't hear me the first time, but I'll say it again. I'll say it again. This here is a pair of headlights for your shoes. You click on them and there is a light that shines out of it. And they very simply and easily snap on your shoes. They work better on shoes like foam runners and Crocs, but we make them work with our tags. You want to make sure you're watching where you're going and not stepping in any kind of nonsense. Dirty your shoes. You gotta get these headlights on. That's all it is. Our last accessory is about taking our shoes, making them a little more personalized and look a little nicer. What are they called? They're called a complicated word that I can't pronounce, but you get them off the Nike website and the Nike by you sort of customizing space and you can get these little accessories, customized whatever you'd like. We went ahead and got MNST. To put together, our shoes will have mainstream on them. And uh, yeah, that's that. If you like this video and the accessories, tell us in the comments what your favorites are and what you're going to go shop. And make sure to subscribe to the channel to stay tuned for our next video. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.